you just heard, there were no keyboard performances, just the occasional pressing of buttons, turning of switches, known in engineering circles as a coded performance, a prepared performance where things are set up, you just press a button and things happen, without the RCA system of society, the same institutions. So I do not have to destroy those institutions for you. But if you are of another race, if you have a different culture, different language, different values, I have to destroy all of those to make you bow to me. And that is the difference between poor black and poor white. Poor whites have their culture, have their values, have their institutions. Ours have been completely destroyed. Completely destroyed. So when you talk about alliances, you recognize you form alliances with people who are trying to rebuild their culture, trying to rebuild their history, trying to rebuild their dignity, people who are fighting for their humanity. Poor white people are not fighting for their humanity, they're fighting for more money. They're fighting... There are a lot of poor white people in this country. You ain't seen none of them rebel yet, have you? Why is it that black people are rebelling? Do you think it's because it's just poor jobs? Don't believe that junk that hunky is running down. It's not poor jobs. It's a question of a people finding their culture, their nature, and fighting for their humanity. For their humanity. For their humanity. For their humanity. It 
is a question of how we regain our humanity and begin to live as a people. And we do not do that because of the effects of racism in this country. We must therefore consciously strive for an ideology which deals with racism first. And if we do that, we recognize the necessity of hooking up with the 900 million black people in the world today. That's what we recognize. And if we recognize that, then it means that our political situation must become international. It cannot be national. It cannot be national. It must be international. Must be international. It must be international because if we knew anything, we would recognize that the honkies just don't exploit us. They exploit the whole third world, Asia, Africa, Latin America. They take advantage of Europe, but they don't colonize Europe. They colonize Asia, Africa, and Latin America. Understand that. If we begin to understand that, then the problems that America is heading for becomes uppermost in our mind. And the first one they're heading for is the conflict in the Middle East. We must be clear on whose side we stand. We can be for no one but the Arabs. There can be no doubt in our mind. No doubt in our mind. No doubt in our mind.
Wheeling and dealing, getting your meals and sleep wherever you can.
I'm not coming back. I'm not coming back. Don't get me wrong. We all had fun. But I'm out. And I'm not coming back.